It's the video everyone is talking about this morning. First responders near St. Louis were caught in icy conditions. Just take a look at that as they tried to rescue drivers caught in icy conditions. This video of a Rock Community fire truck sliding down a hill has been viewed more than 2 million times in just the past 24 hours. Our sister station in St. Louis talked with the field chief and neighbors about the viral video turned safety lesson. Neighbors saw the fire truck weighing more than 56,000 pounds barreled down the ice covered hill near Imperial, meeting the same fate as the driver they were called out to help. Right at like seven o'clock. So uh, we woke up to a loud crash. Um, the blue Chevy Cruze crashed into my car and then was lodged on top of the fire hydrant and electrical box. So we advised her to get out of her vehicle, come over, you know, to safety on the porch. Caitlin Voicey says they then called 911 and while they were waiting, a pickup truck slid down the hill on Parkside Place, followed by the Rock Community fire truck, which slammed into the blue car before sliding into the grass narrowly missing the tan house. We were immediately running over to check on them. Um, if it wasn't for the blue car already being lodged in front of the tree and on the fire hydrant, um, I do think that the fire truck would have flipped uh, once it hit the tree. So um, in all honesty, it was kind of a, it turned out okay. He was a really great driver. So Rock Community Fire Chief Kevin Wing Bermule says his drivers have more than 240 hours of training and it paid off on Monday. So although it happened really quickly, they did have a few seconds and that's what they're trained to do is to stay calm and think on their feet. And he made some adjustments to the truck. Uh, he had an, an exit plan or a plan B, if you would, to to avoid further damage. The chief says the truck even had tire chains in place to try and prevent as much sliding as possible. But no one was going to be invincible in this situation, making it a safety reminder for all. Hey, if this stuff can happen to us in a 50,000 plus pound truck, it can happen to anybody. And and people really need to remind themselves of that when they get out in these hazardous conditions that in a split second, a lot of things can change. The Rock Community Fire Chief says crews did not respond to as many crashes yesterday as they have with similar weather events.